Hey, what's going on everyone? It is TSJ. Welcome back to another install video. This is for Steam and Steel Total War. Um, I did an installation video for this um, for 1.0, I believe. But essentially this takes place in the Victorian era for Medieval 2. There was a 1.1 uh, 1 version release um, uh, last month. And I've been kind of slow getting back into the installation videos, but we're back doing this now. So let's uh, jump into it. Um, so what you're going to do is, and I'll leave a link to this in the first comment below, but click download now, then go to files and find Steam Steel V1.11 and you will extract it to, uh, you can extract it without uh, confirmation, um, but then what you'll find right here is Steam and Steel version 1.11. Uh, make sure you let it kind of um, uh, extract fully first, so we're about 50%. All right, once that's finished, you'll find, again, Steam and Steel. You'll click on the launcher, SNS launcher, okay. So delete existing Steam and Steel. You'll press Y to proceed. So press Y, okay. Just gonna follow the, apply the four gigabyte patch, yes. Okay, and so you will want to uh, see. You want to find the Medieval Two folder, so that's going to be in your common right here. Okay, there we go. Um, click Y again. Just kind of follow the launcher, guys, right? All right, then you'll want to click Install Direct X. All right, then you'll click Finish. Um, don't really need a desktop. Delete installation files. Sure, if you would like to. Okay. Um, then remember, there's that four or that large address or the four gigabyte patch. You'll kind of click on that again which I will leave a link to that guys on where to uh, where to download the four, uh, the four gigabyte patch. All right, so then you will find again, this time Medieval 2 because I did Kingdoms. Make sure that box is checked. Okay. Um, so now that we have done, um, we have installed uh, Steam and Steel, you can then go to your common uh, Medieval 2 mods folder find steam and steel oh it looks like there's already a four gigabyte patch in there anyway i think most mods nowadays you know they have it medieval 2 mods included um let's see run as administrator perhaps sometimes they don't allow that okay there we go all right and then here you are steam and steel again grand campaign so again, this takes place in the mid 19th century during the Victorian era. Um, got a ton of factions to choose from, guys. Um, hopefully, you know that wasn't too difficult for you. Let me know down in the comments below if you do run into any problems, and I will certainly do my best to help you out. Thank you so much for watching. Everyone, stay super, and I'll see you all next time.